guys welcome back to my channel this is Chelsea Chameleon here on YouTube and I'm so excited to be in makeup and full glam I guess and filming another video for you guys um, today I'm going to be filming my Dallas slash Grand Prairie slash shiny world 5 haul I am super 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 excited I even wore my shiny world shirt today for you guys so, um, yeah, I'm super excited. Also, peep the, um, peep the rings on my hat. I just filmed a video, a little tutorial about how you can literally do these for only a dollar, you guys. Um, I made this hat for basically a dollar. So, um, I will definitely be uploading that video for you soon. Hopefully by now you should have already seen my shiny world slash Dallas vlog. Um, I did vlog my whole experience um, on the trip so hopefully this video should be up after that but if not I'll link it down below um, so you can go check that out as well. Alright let's get into the haul. I am super super excited and if I'm looking at the viewfinder a lot I just want to make sure it's recording and make sure my battery doesn't die. <laughs> if you've seen the vlog already you kind of like know where we went when we first arrived to Dallas we got there pretty late so um we stopped at the little co-mart uh like k-pop co-mart eve k-pop pop-up store <laughs> that's a tongue twister so yeah we stopped there um just to run in there real quick to see what they have because we wanted to enter the giveaway for the free poster um unfortunately we didn't get the free poster but um we did like picked up some goodies so here's my bag says Comar. I don't know if you can see. There's my bag um, from this thing. I uh, It's been like two weeks you guys. It's like April now. Um, but I wanted to make sure I got everything in because I was waiting on something um, before I did this haul. So just a little warning. Um, you're probably like why is this so freaking late? But yeah I had to wait till I get like this little gift package thing in. Alright so I'm going to start with what I got at the K-pop pop-up store and then the actual grocery store that was located inside and then move on to like my I guess shiny related stuff. First thing that I got of course of course you all know I love Pocky. Um, I prefer Pepperdo but um, they only sold Pocky and it was like a Korean grocery store. I don't understand but I love the Almond Crush and there is nothing in here because <laughs> I ate them in the car ride um, and I gave them out to my friends. So yeah, I got this. This was like, I think a dollar, so it wasn't too expensive. Um, that store was like really, really cheap. Um, so I, that was a really good thing. Next, I picked up these um, Harpiste, which is like Harvest. There we go. And on the opposite side it says harvest see I picked up these um these I think are supposed to be they have wheat soy sesame and crab and almond which is delicious I love crab and almond um so I plan to actually eat these crackers with like my tuna salads that I make um because I have been not liking bread like sandwich bread from like the grocery store that much so I really want to start using crackers again for my tuna so I picked up these Next, um, I just picked up because it was like less than a dollar. Um, these are barley hardtacks. Um, so this is what the package is. Um, I'm not really sure how I can eat these. And um, Biol Satang, I think that's the company. And then Pori Pori Gopang. I don't know if I said that right. Sorry, native Koreans. I butcher your language. But yeah, um, I can read Korean, I just don't know what this means. Um, I'm just assuming that it means barley hardtack, what it says right there. Um, but yeah, hopefully these aren't bad. Um, if not, I can definitely like make them in like, uh, like tuna salad or something, like with the other crackers. Next I got, this looks, oops, <laughs> this looks really tasty. I got the cafe latte, or in the Korean like pronunciation, cafe latte, um, little cracker biscuits things. These are super super cute. Um, and they, I think yeah, these were less than a dollar too, and they just look so delicious. Like y'all see that? Looks so delicious. So yeah, I got these too. I'm so excited to try these. Um, let me know if you want to see me do like a taste test 
um for some of these um obviously it won't be the same day but i will definitely do like a taste test for like these things because these are like pretty easy to like eat and i don't plan to like use them in like an actual meal so like please let me know if you want to see that that is this like instant bowl of bibimbap uh i probably butchered that word too that's like one of the like harder words for me to say but yeah bibimbap and yeah that's the front it's the vegetable kind um and then like the rice is on top so yeah um it's a really big bowl too like it's almost as big as like my head but yeah um i was super excited to pick this up i think this was about three bucks maybe um in the store which is not bad because this is a really big bowl and this is like a full meal and according to the picture oh, the vegetables and stuff they look so tasty i really hope there's like a dollop of like gochujang or like a little packet of like gochujang sauce because that would make this so delicious i got um this uh like the fire the super spicy fire um lamyon is this yeah this is here we go super spicy fire lamyon um yeah i like the character on it is so cute do you see that so cute um but yeah i think this is like a little bit over a dollar it may have been two dollars but like i said this bowl is pretty big um so yeah and then like i think the spicier it is a little more expensive it is so i am super excited to try this out uh, i'm probably not gonna do like the spicy uh, lamyon challenge because obviously um, i actually did one on my friend's channel um but that was like a year or two ago uh so yeah i'm not really going to like do like a spicy lamian challenge unless you guys really want to see that um because i'm just not really interested in that this channel i don't want this channel to be like a super like korean channel like asian inspired channel like i'm not gonna do reaction videos i'm not gonna do like you know other like k-pop slash korea boo things like that i really don't want to make my channel that i want it to be kind of like a beauty fashion um kind of planner stationary organization like life hack kind of channel with some like korean inspired videos maybe like a makeup tutorial something like that but i don't want that to be like the theme of my channel if that makes any sense but i digress <laughs> last food item i got um, is this nectarine drink and it's so cute this was very 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 overpriced um hopefully it's really tasty um and even though i could read like the letters i don't know if i was supposed to keep this refrigerated <laughs> i um did find this in the refri uh, refrigerated section um so hopefully it can stay non-refrigerated if not I'll just have to test it out and try. Um, but yeah, it's super cute. This was like a dollar or something though. Very, very overpriced. But hopefully this is tasty. If you saw in the vlog, well actually I didn't vlog it at all because I was done shopping at the time. But um, after I checked out from the store, I um, kind of went, like almost exited the store. And there was like this beauty, like cosmetic skincare, like huge section of the store right in the front. And um... I went over there and they had face masks and I was like yes I love face masks I'm getting low on like my forever 21 ones uh, so I was like you know what let me just check out the face mask real quick yeah I'm just gonna go through them this one is the snail uh, face mask and basically it says this product provides enough moisture and nutrition to skin exposed by stimulation from outside and its active component forms protective coat and helps moisture and not evaporate to moisturize your skin. The moisturizer and softener makes your skin healthy, energetic, and clean with enough moisture and nutrition. Um, so yeah, super, super cute. And like I said, these are only a dollar. All right, this one is the potato one. Super, super cute. And then they all say like the same thing on the front. Um, Cause I got three of the same kind and then one is different. And then next is the stem cell one. I'm really excited to try this. I'm like, what are the stem cell components going to do to my face? <laughs> so, yeah. And then the last one I got is called Aqua Collagen Essence Mask. And that's what it looks like. And then it has Japanese right there. Um, and then also Japanese in the back. So, I'm assuming this is like an original Japanese brand that kind of just 
I guess moved your career or whatever. They also had like other like cosmetics selling for like a hundred bucks. I was like, these must be straight off the ship, <laughs> straight out of Korea, like because they were like the same price as like I would pay online. So yeah, um, I actually went to the store a second and then I went to the pop-up store first and I filmed like basically the entire pop-up store. So please check that on my vlog. But the only thing that I picked up in the pop-up store were some shiny stickers. I got these shiny world stickers. They're super cute and it just has like little bubbles or whatever of like all the members and it's really cute. Let me turn this way. This or actually it's this way. <laughs> this really cute um like what do you call it like big sticker I guess of like all the members. Oh my god this is so cute. And one is missing because I gave one to my friend and then there was a banner up here and I put that banner on my laptop. I don't know what to do with these yet, but they were like, I think they were six bucks, which is a little overpriced, but um, it was worth it. That's all that I got like at the Comart and the Eve or whatever it's called pop-up store. Um, and so I only have a couple more items now. Um, I didn't have a light stick. I couldn't purchase one from Soap Culture, so I had to buy one um, from a Shawa on Facebook. Here's my little light stick, and I don't know if you can see. Let me try to... But it says, it says shiny or 2016 shiny fan meet in Dallas. And it has like the SM symbol. But yeah. I don't know if you can see it in the daylight. There we go. See, it's glowy. It's like the aqua pearl, aqua blue color. And like a little glitter. I don't know if you can see like the glitter in it. So, so, so pretty. Hey, but... Thank you to the girl. If you're watching this, thank you for the light stick. It's super cute. Um, my friends who went, unfortunately, couldn't get a light stick. But I was so happy to be waving one. I love this thing. And I love how you can put new batteries in it. And also how you can um, turn it off. So you don't have to, like, waste the battery. <laughs> I pre-ordered a Minho fan. And this is what he looks like. He is beautiful, isn't he? And he's a little rough around the edges right here. Or, yeah, right here. He's a little rough around the edges because I was waving this sucker so hard at the freaking concert. Um, and then I was also like waving myself as well because it was hot. <laughs> and that's what the back looks like. This is probably like my one of my favorite things that I got because it has like his name and then it has like Shiny World 4 which is like the actual like event. So yeah, I love this thing so so much in case you couldn't tell. So this is why um, my video took so long to, uh, or like, I guess come about, <laughs> or this is why it took so long for me to actually film this is because I was waiting on a sweet little package from um, a fellow Shawal, my little Shawal friend on Tumblr. Um, you guys probably know her if you're like a huge Shiny fan. Her name is Brittany, um, also known as Nothing But Soulmates on Tumblr and on YouTube, and I love her videos. Um, she is a John Key shipper. I'm a huge junkie shipper, like junkie trash AF. <laughs> so <laughs> um, I love junkie and I love her videos and her content. And so she was actually um, taking like requests or whatever uh, for like little goodie bags um, to give out at the concert, like when she like would meet us. So um, since we got there so late, <laughs> um, we like literally got to the concert venue at like 7:30, <laughs> like literally like the time that the concert started. So we got there so late, I was not able to meet up with her and get my bag. In advance but she did um, she was sweet enough to mail it to me which is super super sweet thank you so much Brittany and I got this little watch out babe it's like a quote that like he or like John Kian said and it's like this little cute picture of a key I love it next I got this little shiny photo card thing and it just has all the members on it Look at my babies. And then on the little on the back she has um this little note and it says I'm a little sad we couldn't meet, but I hope you enjoy these little things, Brittany. Super super cute. And then I have this little ID badge and it says actual let me see. It says actual junkie trash. And it just has a cute picture of Chunkyun and Ki. 
and it's like a little ID badge. Super, super cute. And then next, I got this amazingly beautiful photo card of Jonghyun. Do you guys see how beautiful this is? So pretty. Also got this little keychain keyring thing, and it just says petite. And it's just Jonghyun in it because he's petite, and that's what key calls him. Super, super cute. And last but not least, on the little bag, she had like this really cute little gift tag. And I'm literally going to hang this up on my wall. And it's a really, really shiny, like, little diamond. Kind of like shiny symbol. So pretty. And on the back, she just has my name and then my Tumblr name. And she says, thank you. So sweet. Um, You can go follow me on Tumblr. But my Tumblr is wow. My Tumblr is basically nothing but, like, twice shippings, junkie shippings, and me being total trash. So, um, you can't follow me on Tumblr. I'm not going to link it down below. If you were quick enough to catch it in that clip, then you can go follow me. But, um, I will not be linking my Tumblr down below. <laughs> um, so yeah. Uh, this is super, super cute. Thank you so much, Brittany. She's so sweet. Y'all should follow her. I'll probably, like, link her, um, channel and her Tumblr down below. I'll link that down below for you guys because she's super cute and super sweet. Um, but yeah, that is all that I got in Dallas slash Grand Prairie because technically we really weren't in Dallas. We were in Grand Prairie, Texas. Um, but yeah, that's all I got for like the Dallas Grand Prairie slash Shiny World 5 um, trip, I guess, <laughs> event. If you want to see that vlog, then I will have it down below or have it right here for you guys to check out because it's pretty cool and I'm still in shock. I'm still shook that I was able to go to that concert. <laughs> it's like, it was my life dream and I'm so happy that I went. Um, but yeah, this is all for uh, this video. Um, I'm going to try to make it not as long. You're probably like, that was nothing. It was mostly food, but food is life. So <laughs> um, if you guys don't like food, you don't have to watch it, just saying. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, that is all. I hope you guys like it. If you like it, leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And go check out my vlog. Like I said, I really worked hard on editing the vlog, so I want you guys to check it out. And um, yeah. I will see you guys in another video. Hopefully you can get to check this video out soon. So you can be looking like Jung Hyun at the airport <laughs> with your little idol ring hat. Alright, I will talk to you guys later. Sending lots of heart to and love. And remember to stay colorful. Bye-bye.